Sadly, I was thrown into this world and forced to become an expert on the issues we are here to discuss when on January 15th of 2005, both my boyfriend and his best friend were murdered. Quick fact check. This is one of the witnesses Jim Jordan paraded out as his traveling circus made it to New York City to supposedly hold a hearing on crime under Alvin Bragg's time as district attorney. One problem. This supposed New York City crime victim of Alvin Bragg's policies, well, her boyfriend was killed in 2005 in New Jersey. Jim Jordan and Republicans are exploiting victims of crime in order to try to intimidate a district attorney into dropping a case against the criminal who just so happens to be the leader of their party. If these Republicans truly cared about crime, they would be working to keep guns off our streets, or they would focus on red states. Eight out of the 10 states with the highest murder rates all voted for Trump. The homicide rate in Jim Jordan's state of Ohio is 49% higher than New York City's homicide rate, and Mansfield, Ohio, in Jim Jordan's district, is even nicknamed Danger City because it's one of the most crime-ridden states in the country. So maybe instead of trying to protect criminals, the Republicans should focus on fixing their own problems first.